What is good, YouTube family? Dropping a little video um, concerning the coronavirus. Um, we've been getting updates since Wednesday, so a couple of days now. My school had to shut down because, you know, of the virus and they have to take safety precautions. We're not infected, but we have to take safety precautions. And so I'm here. My spring break started a little early and they're gonna be transitioning to online classes about a week after spring break. And so students have the choice to either stay at home or go back on campus. And personally, I wanna stay here at my house instead of going back to campus. Not only is it a long drive, I really don't wanna be on campus in the midst of a crisis like this um but yeah that's kind of what i wanted to talk about the coronavirus how it's affecting people i've i've been literally looking at reports for the past day or two since i've been home um the death toll has risen up to about 41 um different health officials you know predict that it's gonna get progressively worse um the best thing that we can really do is just simple stuff that we should, you know, wash our hands, use sanitizer, don't touch your face, don't touch your eyes or nose or mouth, um, because our hands are the most dirtiest part of our bodies. Um, don't pick our noses, things like that. Just simple stuff. Um, yeah, simple stuff that we should have already been doing before the coronavirus ever hit, you know. Our radar but um you know just simple basic stuff um yeah this video isn't gonna be long but just kind of a quick reminder just be cautious of the, the coronavirus stay away from crowded places if anything if you feel like you might have the virus or feel sick contact your provider right away seek help don't go to the doctor right away but call them and let them know because if you go to the doctor you'll run the risk of having them everybody get infected in the office but talk to your provider stay home um i think i saw some type of post stating that you know if you feel like you might have the virus so quarantine yourself and stay home for a couple days if needed but um yeah i the last time i witnessed like a pandemic like this was probably the swine flu that was like 10 years ago without 10 years ago or a little over 10 years ago i was in elementary school at the time but yeah that's kind of the last time i've ever heard or even saw like uh um a major pandemic like this and with the swine flu about 10 years ago it came from a pig in mexico and i know kids at our school and making all kinds of jokes about it and inside jokes about it it was a really big thing back then as so another the coronavirus is here, I'm kind of a little bit concerned. Um, and it's also kind of making me really, I guess, pay more attention to the news and also to health things in general. Because I'm aspiring to become a health professional myself. And I think watching this virus kind of like revived my passion for medicine. Because right now I'm going through a period of whether pursuing medicine or science in general is the right career path and because i haven't really shown interest like that but i think this ironically this you know unfortunate crisis kind of like revived me and kind of revived my interest in you know doing medicine and possibly working in health public health um but yeah um it kind of also inspired me to do more research on this virus because we don't know where it came from apparently from some news outlets I've heard that there's like several types of coronaviruses there's like more than one and I feel like this one might be a different strain but I'm gonna keep you guys posted and updated on that and I'm gonna continue to do some research and take precaution of myself because we don't know how bad this virus is gonna be and how it's gonna progress over the next couple of months or even a month who knows all we can do is just pray all we can do is just like like I said maintain a good hygiene, social distance ourselves, just do basic stuff like that. It's not really hard. It really isn't. Um, but yeah, 
that's all I kind of wanted to go over today since it's really a big hot topic of the news right now, the coronavirus. So make sure to like, comment, and share your thoughts on this pandemic. Um, share any safety tips that you have that, you know, would be beneficial. Um, make sure to wash your hands. Like I said, wash your hands. That's literally probably the only way you can, like, not even get this virus. Wash your hands. Simple. Simple, Simon. Um, but yeah, hope you like this video. Um, stay tuned for more videos, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.